ignition. Lift off. Lift off. Baby, perfect. What's up guys, it's the only ninja wearing aviators and a super rare hat and welcome to the Modern Ninja YouTube channel. Today is the next episode of our four part series breaking down this awesome sword combo that you saw in the beginning of the video. Now just to remind you guys, if this is the first one you're seeing, we'll make sure you go check out the beginning. But if you don't want to do that, make sure you do get a safe sword. Seatbelts! So we can be safe! These are tricking swords made for stuff like this so you don't actually cut yourself. So, if you're interested in getting one for yourself, definitely check out the link I have down below at centurymartialarts.com and use my code NINJA10 at checkout for 10% off your sword of choice. But now we got all the safety stuff out the way, let's break down the striking combination. Now we last left off right around here, we we're getting ready to go into our striking combination. Now our first two strikes are going to be going towards the high and low target zone. So we're going to step out with our left leg and strike up towards the top left, the high target zone, just like this, just bang. And then what you're going to do is you're going to come around and strike towards the low target zone. And all this is, is you're facing your fingers in the direction of the strike that you're going at. So that way your blade always faces your target. So once you have your first strikes, making sure you switch stances going this way and that way then you're actually going to do a sweeping uppercut style strike with your blade going upwards just like so and this is literally just sweeping underneath until your sword goes straight out parallel to the ground just like that so our first three strikes go one two and three and then it's your cleaver strike or over the head strike and then you're going to be stepping out with your right leg just like so now here's the first trick in this combination it's going to be a simple forwards toss if you've seen some of my other tutorials i've done the three basic sword tosses going forward backwards and horizontal those are your three basic sword tosses if you want more details i'll leave a link somewhere around there for you to click on but it's just going to be a simple toss just like this now the thing that makes this challenging is the immediate bounce into a reverse because it's not catch catch that's not what it is what it looks like is a bounce just like that and how you simulate that how you simulate that bounce is simply by using your fingers and as your sword flips in the air you're going to hit it back in the other direction so when you've done your cleaver strike you're going to toss toss and you're going to want to make sure you catch it palm down just like so so our striking combo looks something like this one two three four Five. Now for all you advanced guys that want to make it a little bit harder, try and keep your toss somewhere below your shoulders. If you toss it in the air, great. It doesn't look like you have all that much control. But if you want it to look effortless and if you want it to look controlled, keep it below your shoulders. And then just like before, we're going to finish the second set with a spin. Specifically, once you catch it, you're going to come around and around. All your hand is doing around your head to your hip around your head and to your hip all while your body spins so when you get the spin all together it looks pretty cool now guys thank you guys for checking out this video make sure you hit me with the hbo special and help a brother out by liking commenting and subscribing so i can get to 75,000 subscribers by the end of the year it's a big goal but it's my goal and I appreciate it. And if you really want to help out the channel, check out the merch link down below. Because if you're watching this, you are the Ninja fam. So you might as well rep it. Am I right? He's out of line, but he's right. It's great. But until next time, my name's DJ Moore. This is the Modern Ninja, and I'm out.